for the headwaters that run into Lake Evie Spence from the Colorado River. There has been a lot of flooding and a lot of rain. If you've paid attention to the national news or if you're from Texas, you certainly know we've been dealing with torrential rains and flooding statewide. And Texas is a huge state, so that's saying something. And this lake is twice as full as it was before. Simply because of the rains we've had over the past few weeks. And we're looking for... Yeah, here's the Colorado River right here. So we're going to see if we can get down there and see just how much water is flowing. At this point, normally there's hardly any water in this part of the river. So let's check it out. Oh yeah, man. That is impressive. That's some brown water. A little muddy. A little muddy. A little turbid. Been drinking muddy water, sleeping in a hollow log. Yeah. Turbidity is <laughs> yes, the turbidity is high. Yeah, you can see right up over here how high it got. Here comes a car. We're on a narrow bridge. Gots to be careful. And it comes. Yeah. Here a while back. The water was all the way. They hit me there. Wow, wow. I live, I live on the quarter of a mile from the river, and it was within 200 yards of my house. I bet you were nervous. I never had to go that last day. <laughs> well, you can see how high the river got up on that side, all the way up to that tree line. That is incredible. Yeah, it, was, it was not very far below them five. Uh huh. It was big. Where y'all from? We're from Midland. Yeah, that's, y'all yeah. from Midland, huh? Yeah. Day. It's a beautiful day for a ride. We're going to enjoy it. <laughs> enjoy it. All right. Have a good day, sir. Yeah. yeah. No, me neither. <laughs> this is about as close as I'm going to get. Because look how goo. It looks like chocolate pudding. You'd probably sink three feet deep in that stuff like quicksand and not be able to get out of it. <laughs> probably. <laughs> Pretty wet. What you guys are looking at right here is my Texas, if that makes any sense. Like, when I think of Texas, when I'm homesick for Texas, this is what I think of. These grasslands, these mesquite trees, coming up on a little lake, this hill country with this red dirt. I don't know, man. It, I know I'm home when I'm in an environment like this. You guys ever feel like that? Do you have a place where you go that you know, man, this is where I was born to be? That's what West Texas is for me. Ah, oh, what a beautiful day, what a beautiful place. Let's go check out the water. Oh yeah, that lake's full. You guys can't see it right now on the GoPro, but yeah, it's really full.
What a perfect ride day. Good times with friends. We'll see you guys on the next episode of Tim Kreitz Adventures. Until then, take care of yourselves. Take care of one another. Bye.